They think the poem that, uh, <laughs> I don't even know if I can do it because there's some young people here in the front row, and it's about this affair I had with a stripper. <laughs> so it's just weird when you're like six and a half years old. And what's crazy, I don't know if I can do that poem now that I'm looking out. But you can check that poem online, and the crazy thing is, for like bands here that are fans of Zuko, someone went through the whole poem and has, has Zuko doing the poem. It's just crazy. They edited the whole thing. I don't know how they did that or how long it took, but it was crazy. I got a piece of it. I knew this girl named Nikki. I guess you could say she was a sex fiend. I mean, she was a dancer. Well, actually a stripper. That is to say, to see a naked you have to pay. Anyway, one night I was in a devious mood. I rendezvous with my boys in the club up the street. Live, totally new girls. Ten bucks ahead, 18 and over. You must have ID. So there I sit in this seedy joint, tripping with fear, wondering what would my mom think if she ever caught me here. Then out comes this girl, petite physique, body was perfect to me, you see, then I was caught in a moment. I'm looking at her, looking at me, something strong I sensed as she danced, removing articles of clothing off her body, but not once removing her eyes off of me, and I thought that either she was the greatest dancer in the world, or somehow we managed to touch something real, a connection. Something pure, something powerful, a purely powerful, the animalistic connection. Now let me continue, I want to get in you, or let me slow down. See what I'm saying? This, now this is going crazy, Steven. It's going crazy. We have a six-year-old in the front seat. <laughs> we can leave that story for later on. Check that one out. That was like a little sneak of it. <laughs>